We had a dream. A dream of possessing a naval force that stands shoulder to shoulder with other great nations to achieve world peace. During the times when ROC Navy did not own a single warship, Admiral Son Won Il, the forefather of the ROC Navy, along with his fellow sailors, headed to the United States to purchase a literal petrol vessel. From then on, never did we stop but push ahead with our very first warship, Pek Du San, which held our people's efforts blood and sweat. In 1980, the 1800-ton frigate opened an era of indigenous warships, followed by 14,000-ton LPH rockets Tokdo in 2005, 7,600-ton Aegis destroyer rockets Sejong the Great in 2007, and 3,000-ton medium-class submarine rockets Tosan and Changho. Finally, Republic of Korea Navy achieved a core role in defending our waters, in turn possessing world-class naval power. At present, ROC Navy holds a critical role by actively cooperating with our allies and partners, utilizing the wider ocean and a larger world as our stage. By overcoming hardships and struggles whilst demonstrating outstanding performances, ROC Navy RIMPEC Training Group has been writing its history. RIMPAC, Rim of the Pacific Exercise, is the largest combined maritime exercise in the world, seeking to secure sea lines of communications and improve joint response capability among Pacific nations. ROC Navy marks 17th participation this year and first participation back in the year of 1990, accompanied by two 1800 frigates, Rocket Seoul and Rocket Masan. In 1998, Rocket Lee Jong Mu was the first submarine to take part in the exercise, and in 2006, ROC Navy conducted a multinational CTU commander for the first time. Furthermore, in 2010, Aegis destroyer Sejong the Great made its first appearance and from 2014, ROC Navy demonstrated its status by performing Sea Combat Commander for Carrier Strike Group and Expeditionary Strike Group. In 2022, Republic of Korea Navy RIMPEC Training Group will make the largest ROC Navy participation ever with forces including three surface combatants, one submarine, three aircrafts, Marine Corps troops, and nine KAVs. In this exercise, the first ROC Navy will be assuming the duty of CTF-176, Commander of Expeditionary Strike Group for the first time. Amphibious landing ship ROC Esmarado, 214-class submarine Shin Dorsa, KAV and mobile construction team are participating. The greatest. ROC Navy will have the largest force ever and command the largest number of combined staffs and subordinate forces. The best. ROC Navy will have a flag officer level participation as commander of ESG, the highest ever role of ROC Navy will hold in RIMPAC. ROC Navy RIMPAC training group has been making new history when everyone deems it difficult and when everyone deems it impossible. To contribute to the peace and stability around the world, the best forces and crew members of ROC Navy have gathered in one place. 2022 Republic of Korea RIMPAC training group will aggregate its best efforts to vigorously conduct given missions and ensure a successful exercise.